I think if I was trying now uh, to determine in what way do I probably differ from a lot of urologists and where my practice tends to be a bit more unique, I think it stems from my experience with robotic prostatectomy in that my, my attitude towards PSA screening and how readily I will offer a biopsy and specifically how readily I will actually offer treatment it tends to have a much higher bar than others. I'm not very test heavy. I follow the PSA trend more than anything else. I don't look for reasons to biopsy people. I look for reasons why not to biopsy people. Uh, and I will understand and remember of the 3,000 patients that I've performed robotic surgery on, it's not lost upon me that there was a bygone era where we used to overtreat people. We didn't know, but we did, which means by definition, I have affected people's lives where some people may not have needed to be treated in retrospect. So I take the need to be treated very seriously, and I usually follow people and only biopsy them when I know I'm going to offer them treatment.